Here we go downstairs. And things look for the most part really good. Got the fan running just to keep things nice and dry. And let's look for my friend's uh, books here. I'm sitting outside because I'm not really eager for these fumes to go inside. And once we do the cleaning, we're going to keep the books out here in the sunshine so they can dry like we want them to. I see that is both prestigious and highly uh, disgusting. In Pursuit of Wisdom by who? Abe Kaplan. I'm going to take some of this Clorox, take the, take the top off there. Now, if you just brush it off to start with, the particles just go flying all over the place and they, you know, attack your nose and things. And so I'm not going to do that. I'm going to first take this uh, Clorox uh, wipe and I'm just going to press down on it because if you get it wet first, then it can't just jump into the air. Okay, this is another hard backer. And I'm not soaking them, I'm just making them a little damp. Bit of this, little bit, little bit of this, little stuff over here, some little stuff over here, little stuff over here, just right. Yeah, just like that, just like that, okay, that's right. Just like that, okay. Okay, so now what we do is we um we take the gourmet and we spray kind of a light mist. The same over here. And then you leave to dry, I think at least 10 minutes. Okay, and then you can take a fresh. Now you try to wipe the gunk off. It's not gonna go flying all over the universe, poisoning people. The philosophy might. But if there's a cure for that, I don't know what it is. You can see these aren't completely cleaned. Once they dry in the sunshine, they'll look pretty appealing to some of you. Phenomenology and the crisis of philosophy. It's a little overdramatic there. Reason and God was written by Prince, I think. And now that it's disinfected, maybe you want it. Philosophy, contemporary issues, contemporary for the 70s. Hyposhabonitz, omnipotence and other theological mistakes. It's a raving atheist there. A preface to philosophy. It's like an entire book of thanking people who help with the book. We are like that little red dot in a white square in a tan square. Not in every way. Analogies always break down somewhere. Understanding moral philosophy. Apparently it's very difficult. I think that's a 500 page book. Ethics, the state, justice and the law, and this one that you're supposed to read upside down. They've been out here for a while, these books. My plan was to have them dry, but as you can tell, it has seriously rained. We had a real downpour there, and I wasn't about to bring these disgusting books back inside. No offense to those of you who want to buy these books, but let's just say that I'm, I'm more trapped in the material world than you are. What do we like? We like big brains! What do we like? We like big brains! Why? Maybe the sun will shine someday. What do we like? We like big brains. What do we like? We like big brains. Why? On these books. What do we like? We like big brains. What do we like? We like big brains. Why? New takers.